Hey everybody, it's your girl Denise here with BraidersPlus.com. Um, I'm coming to you with this video about Puerto Rico out of all places. Being that I got the new client in Alaska, it had me thinking about Hawaii and all the little territories that I'm at control, like Washington, D.C., not Washington the State, and Puerto Rico, which is the D.C. of District of Columbia. So I came over here so y'all could see these people are absolutely nuts. As you can see, it says the Puerto Rico Department of Estiario. I guess being a school, I don't know, student or something. I don't know. But barber and barber stylist. The reason why that's important is because guess what? Everything they got in another language. Now, look, this is the um, barber license for a barber stylist. This is the renewal and this is the learners permit. Now, you click that to go to the barber license, and you get over here, they, they ask you, do you want it in Spanish or English? I want it in English, so that's what it said at. Here are the requirements for a barber license, all right? Even when you get over here to get your barber license, you have to get in the certificate. You also have to upload the completion of your certificate right here and print this form and send it. That's the form that's in Mexican or whatever, uh, Spanish. Then the problem I have with it is they also want you to give them pictures of a passport. They want you to pay $25. They want your criminal record. Okay, let's click that. Oh, it's gone. It's gone to the way back thing. Okay, but they want your criminal record and any penalties you didn't have. They also want um, if you have any minor kids, like if you owe child support, Upload digital. Let me highlight it for y'all. This is shocking, okay? They want you to upload a negative debt certificate from the administrator of support of minors. So if you got child support as a man in uh, Puerto Rico, you will not be cutting nobody her. These people are absolutely nuts over here. I don't know when somebody going to get over here. They said they want your birth certificate. Look at this. They want your recent birth certificate, okay? They want too much stuff. And you got to click these little buttons and there go the, the uh, child support thing that you got to do, okay? See, this is from the child support, but it's way back when, so I guess they done took it off. I don't know. But I get over here, I'm just totally, totally shocked at all of this stuff that they got. Okay, here go the form that they want you to do in, to cert certify yourself. It's all in Spanish, okay? So it says certification of going to school, I guess, and being a barber. I certify. I know some of this. This is a photographia of students. stuff. I know some of this stuff because I took Spanish. But listen, this is too much. And I even took Spanish, so this is too much. This is the affidavit they want. Yo, this, that, and the other that you did, all this stuff. It's all in Spanish. Then on top of that, they want all this money and a bunch of pictures. So my advice to anybody that want to go all the way to Puerto Rico, see, they want $200. You got to take the theory and the re-exam for the theory, okay? Then you got to contact these people. It's just too much stuff, so... That's why I came to y'all. For anybody that want to get this certification, I'll put it over there for you. But as it seems right now, if you go to Puerto Rico, you're going to be taking everything. And what they got for us all to take is too much. Thank you. Bye.